Hello everybody, this is Grandma Griggly of the day and we're going to be doing a pinting and I'm going to show you for today and this is the pintings we're going to be doing snowdrops or rat picter and there's an art picter and it doesn't have to be in black it can be in any colour right so uh, I'm going to Deep big on here so you can get a wee bit practice before I do it on the rough paper. This is the paper that I'm going to do it on. And what you need is a bit of paper and I've gotten some colours and I've gotten some green pencils and paint brushes. Okay? Now, how I start my snowdrops. I get three teardrop shapes and I'm going to do it my big pen so you can see if it is the test I'm doing. So that's one teardrop, that's another teardrop and a third teardrop. And then in here I'll be yellow with the frilliberty and then we're going to give the snowdrop a heart and then with the green pencil we're going to be doing a stack and you can snowdrop have a, a little thing you look at it at up. I've got colour out it. Now you can easily you do it with pencil on your paper first if you like. But I'm just getting straight in with my paint. But you that's for you. Now the other thing is it, to do a bud. I like to do a bud in a and the bud is just one teardrop with a heart. a single one it has to quite come up open yet okay i'll give it a wee start now i'll maybe quick but you can tap your time now if it kind of brush lines i think i'll use this brush here again i've used my puppy pads if i find for dicting my my brush on now let's see i'm going to try and do this upside down now i'm going to do one teardrop and two teardrops and a third teardrop and then maybe I'll maybe do a curtain so I'll maybe do and then maybe face in a different boy so it's one teardrop two and three and with a fight pint now colour that in and then I'll maybe do a, a bud so that's just the one teardrop okay now the next thing i'm going to do is i put in a little bit you can see i like to deft my brush on here i've got a bit of yellow here and there's a bit of yellow because the, the snowdrops have like a little yellow frill in between this bit is here just this too you can have as much snowdrops as you like on your picture your mums and dads, maybe here I go with this. Right? Now, then I have teen a green pencil. I find it awfully difficult to mark off a thin lines for stacks. So, fit on the end is giving the snowdrops their little heart. Right? I hope you're managing to see us me doing this upside down. And then I'm going to take a stacks. Doing my cut and then another in crossing our look at and another in look at now in the bitties up its side and the little secret to this is I need a little wee bit of a, a blue very very thin 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 blue pint because you need to kind of give them a, a bit of shadow and I just put in a two or three shadows in amongst the fight. That's maybe just a bit too dark. So I'll just get a dicht on my puppy pad, lift that up, and that just gets a wee bit of a, a, a bit of a shadow. It gets a bit of a, a three dimensional. Okay, my dad used to call me his little snowdrop, so I love snowdrops. My favourite. And that was when I was a queenie. Yeah, I like being a snowdrop. No. What do you see for you put a frame on of that? Now. 
reckon you would just put your name on it. What do you think of that? Eh? Would you like to hear go with that? I hope so. Okay. Let's have a shout. Daddy bye.